chill review video for you guys because I'm using a new microphone that I received from a company called Mono I think that's how you pronounce it Mono, Mono, Mono I'll put the, uh, the website in the description and they gave me this microphone to try out so Officially, this is like a podcast um, microphone or microphone to record um, music, singing, guitars, you name it. So I'm really curious to see or to hear how it performs with ASMR. So the microphone came this arm, I think it's called a boom arm, and this little pop filter, it makes a interesting sound when you touch it. So we got the pop filter and a shock, um, shock mount, and I also got this extra pop filter. I didn't install this yet for two reasons. I think it's a little too big for this video. It will probably cover my whole face. And I wasn't really sure where to put this thing. It wasn't very clear for me uh, from the manual. So, I'll just uh, see what I can do with that later, but for now, we're just gonna do it with this setup. So, keep in mind that this is um, podcast, a podcast mic, recording mic, but we're just gonna see how it performs with ASMR. So... Covered with like 
button at the front which is actually a touch screen thingy so you just touch it and a little light turns red and you touch it again and a little light turns blue or turquoise <laughs> I think that's actually really cool judging on the appearance I think the mic looks really neat and nice like the material that it's made of is like a black matte metal and it feels heavy and good quality also the boom arm doesn't look cheap it looks like good quality i've had a boom arm from aliexpress before terrible thing i'm sorry they used a lot of plastic and this is all just heavy metal material
seems to be an uneven balance in the sound waves in comparison to my Blue Yeti. It's like pretty balanced. Oh, I think holding the bubble wrap paper here at the side. as well. Um, hello. <laughs> this is a weird transition. Um, I don't know. I'm trying to speak as much as I can into the front. If I go down like this, it sounds different than if I go up a little more like this. If I go to the side, it has a different sound. Um, yeah, I think Overall, this sounds this sounds pretty okay. Soft speaking, I mean. I think this whole mic overall is pretty nice, especially for its price. I mean, you get a boom arm, you get everything, you get the entire package, which I'm actually quite happy with because my blue yeti is so heavy for a boom arm i don't know what boom arm to use for it it's always standing in front of me when i record when i stream which is actually quite annoying and bothering me so i'm really happy to have a mic with a boom arm i'm definitely gonna try out this mic during streams upcoming streams see what people think of it and otherwise i'll just keep this one as my streaming mic and i'll leave the blue yeti for the asmr um YouTube videos, but I do think this is a nice mic. It doesn't pick up a lot of small details and quality in your voice, in your tapping when you're making ASMR videos, so it might be a bit more suitable for podcasts, normal YouTube videos with a regular voice instead of whispers. Although I do have to say that it picks up quite some mouth sounds when you're really up close, but no one's gonna be that close. I mean, you can for ASMR. So yeah, it would definitely be nice for streaming podcasts, regular YouTube videos. I do think I'll stick to my Blue Yeti, <laughs> but I'm definitely gonna try this in streams. But I do want to know your opinion. So let me know what you think of this mic. I know that sometimes it can be quite refreshing and triggering for ASMR to have like a different mic or a little less quality. 